All right, you guys, we have an IC real-time NVR. It's making a beeping noise, so that's a good indicator that the hard drive is failing. So we're gonna go ahead and open this up and look at the hard drives and probably replace them. So we're gonna go to the back here. You can see we have just the one screw up here and that's it to take off this top cover. So let's go ahead and remove the top cover. Once you remove that top cover, you're gonna see we have two hard drives in here and we're gonna remove them both because both of them have been failing and we've been getting a beeping noise in this particular uh, DVR. So we're gonna disconnect the cables. And then we're gonna unscrew the screws holding the hard drives in. All right, we got our two six terabyte drives that we're replacing these two drives with. One was a one terabyte and a six terabyte, and we're gonna replace them with two six terabytes so we get plenty of recording storage. So let's go ahead and replace these drives back where they were at with the new ones. All right, we got our first drive in, SATA K1, power, and we screwed it in. Now let's go ahead and get the top panel on. And now we can put our second drive up in this bay. All right, we mounted our second drive now. Go ahead and plug in the power. And our SATA cable. And Let's go ahead and put the cover on, the screws on. Now we need to boot this back up and go into the console and format these drives so then you can start recording. Once you log into console, you're gonna to wanna to go to the setup tab, and then you're gonna to go to storage media, and you can see now we have the two hard drives that are showing up as normal status, both showing in the six terabytes, and we're gonna click on one and hit format, then hit save, and then it's gonna format the operation on reboot, and we have to do that to both the drives. And then you guys should be all set for recording again. Hope this video was helpful. See you guys in the next one. Thanks.